Tonight's matchup in the quarterfinal round of the 5A District 3 football playoffs features number five seed Warwick and number four seed Mannheim Central. Now those Barons looking to get back to the District 3 championship game and try to win it for the third year in a row, which would be their record topping 19th overall time. But it's another team in Mannheim starting to develop a championship culture of their own, the Mannheim Central girls soccer team. It's kind of become the standard at this point in Mannheim. Uh, get back to that title game, defend our uh, defend our title this year. It was amazing. I mean, I was there freshman year when we made history there and just to be back there again senior year and win three nothing like that's just crazy. It was great. It felt great uh, to see that same team. Uh, both teams wearing the same exact uniforms on the same exact field. We were on the same sidelines. Uh, it was reminiscent of the year before, but it was a completely different game. This year we really took care of business when we had to uh, and that's what we were hoping after that first goal happened tonight. Um, but to see them really take over that game in the district final, uh, that, that felt really good. Just last Friday, on what was the opening night of football playoffs in District 3, the Lady Barons had the spotlight shining bright on their program as they raised the AAA trophy high above their heads for the second straight year, third overall in school history. Mannheim Central beat Mechanicsburg 3-0 in the title game, handing the Wildcats back-to-back -back losses in the District 3 finals. Contributing on the scoreboard for the Lady Barons, as they have all season long, the three leading scorers on the team, McKenna Copley, Isabella Wendler, and Hannah Adair. Copley and Wendler have been there for multiple championships, making this senior class one for the record books. It's easy to say that the senior class is so impressive with three district titles now. We lost a lot last year. We lost four really long-time uh, starters for varsity, uh, but we filled in a uh, new, new person in that role, and they maintain that same level. Same level, meaning continued excellence on the field. A 20-win season in back-to-back -back years is a record to go along with the championships. And thanks to Mannheim Central's win in the first round of states and penalty kicks, a return trip to the quarterfinal round ties the furthest the program has ever gone. We're looking to go one step further in everything we do. Get to that semifinals for the first time, uh, get that 21st win for the first time. Uh, these girls want to make that, set down that mark that they're the best in program history.